Hi, my name is Harold Enger from Spring Green Lawn Care, and I'm here to talk to you today about billbug grubs. Billbugs are probably the most misdiagnosed insect in most home lawns, and they can attack both warm season and cool season grasses. There's several different varieties. There's the hunter billbug, there's the annual bluegrass weevil, there's the bluegrass billbug. A lot of these are very small. Now there's two stages that are damaging to turf. The adult stage, which is a weevil, which means it has a snout on it. Uh, it's called a snout beetle, and it will feed on the grass blades. Not a lot, it'll feed on the edges. You'll get these little, um, half moon shaped cuts into the grass. That's how they're feeding on it. But of course, mom is laying her eggs into the stem of the grass blade. And those eggs hatch, the larvae go down in through the middle of the grass blade. They will feed through the middle. They will get down into the, into the base of the plant. They'll start feeding on the root system. Now you don't see them because you know, a lot of people when they think about grubs, they think about those big ones that they see in the fall. These are actually occurring, they can occur in the spring, in the summer, or even into the late summer or fall. You can get them all year long depending on where you are and what variety you're dealing with or what species you're dealing with. So the only way to tell is to take what's called the tug test. You see these little brown areas in your lawn and you take and pull on the grass. If it just pulls up real easily, then you can look at the base of that and you will see what looks like little bits of grains of sand at that and that's actually what's called frass, or frass is just the fancy name for insect droppings, and that's what's left over of your grass after they've finished feeding on it. And they will kill that plant in that area. And the grub itself is very tiny. Oh, quarter to three-eighths of an inch long. It doesn't have a, uh, legs, it is white and it has a reddish head, but they don't travel very far once they get, in the, uh, once they get to uh, the, the later instars or the later molting or stages of that uh, insect. So if you want to find out more information about billbugs or have your lawn checked to see if you have billbugs, contact your neighborhood lawn care professional at Spring Green or visit our website at www.spring-green.com. I encourage you to click on Ask the Expert link and send me a question. I will answer it and get back with you as soon as I can. Thank you.